When you come to Bible of the Church, it's all about Jesus. When you come to the church, we think of nobody in fellowship but Jesus. And when you come here, we read the book of Jesus. There are three books you ought to bring in, in, uh, uh, in the church when you come. First, God's book. How many of you have a Bible? God's book. The second one, we didn't bring it anymore, the song book. But because we have already in the screen, God's book, song book, and uh, pocket book. <laughs> For offering, diva, right? You have to make an offering. And you do it in the pocket book. Raise your Bible up, please. Raise your Bible. Everybody standing. Let's welcome by the beast for today. Give a big hand of welcome, Brother Bispo. Wala, wala na ito. Thank you. you. Please be seated. Glad to be back in my home church. I got saved here. I grew up here. But I'll not die here because I'm there in Tago. <laughs> Well, doctor gave me this gadget here. I thought this is a hearing aid. <laughs> Speaking aid. <laughs> because I have 70% uh, hearing. Impaired na ko. I'm impaired. My eyes, the right eye has 50%. Ang akong uh, left eye is 70%. But I am 100% still for the Lord. And I like that song. It's all about you, Jesus. It's not, it's not about us. It's all about Jesus. It's not about you. Because if you, it's all about you, it's all about us. Dali lang ito mag-backslide kay masakitan man tani. But if it's all about Jesus, ah, stay put ta, no matter what. Yeah. Will that be? Hindi ta onion skin. And I'm glad that uh, Pastor Dr. Gisalba, my pastor, has uh, invited me here. Well, you know, this, uh, yesterday I invited myself to the church of Brother Ayans. I go, you let me preach you in your church. Wala nang invite sa akong dito, so ako nang invite sa akong sarili sa mga churches. Well, anyway, uh, Dr. Gisalba invited me. And it's an honor, a great honor to be invited to this church where I have preached so many messages. I grew up here and, uh, you know, it's all, uh, alma mater natin to. Uh, please open your Bible to Mark chapter 8, verse 36 and 37. And let us please stand up as uh, we read the two verses of the scripture, Mark 8, chapter 36 and 37. If you are there, say amen, amen. because we are going to read this together. Sabay sabay tayo. Mark 8, chapter 30, Mark 8, 36 and 37. Are you? If you are there, let's read it together. Read. For what shall I profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? Father in heaven, thank you, O God, that we have freedom to preach the Bible in this country. Lord, thank you that your Bible stands. And Lord, thank you that uh, we can open our Bible with uh, the uh, expectation that we can find the whole truth about Jesus Christ in it. Because this Bible is all about Jesus Christ. And Lord, this, tonight I'm thankful that uh, we can have our Bible to share with each other the word of god and lord i pray that as i preach i pray oh god that you give me the unction to preach the word preach the word preach the word preach the word and lord i'm thankful that uh, you have allowed me to become uh, a preacher of the word and lord tonight i ask oh god that you'll give me oh lord the uh, uh, wisdom the power lord everything that i need to be able to preach 
with the uh, a, to to preach to the heart of people. I pray, O oh God, that tonight let Your name be glorified in our midst, because if, without You, we cannot do anything. Lord, you just give you all the praise and the honor as we lift up your name in our midst. In Jesus' name, amen. Please be seated. For what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? Make so on. Ang atong kalag is your everything. Tagaan-tagkalag sa ginoo. But you know, our body is composed of uh, three. Uh, trichotomy, sabi nila, trichotomy. If you will open with me to you, your Bible with in 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 23, we read there, 1 Thessalonians <coughs> chapter 5, <coughs> we read there that <clears throat> and the very God of peace sanctify you wholly and I pray God your whole spirit and soul and body be preserved blameless unto the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ so our, 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 we are composed of three uh, parts body, soul and spirit now this body is what communicates with the environment ah uh, the the spirit is what communicates with god where uh, you, uh, look at ezekiel let's look, to make it clear ezekiel chapter 3 verse 21 what happens to the spirit ay ezekiel ecclesiastes chapter 3 verse 21 Ecclesiastes chapter 3 verse 21 the Bible says who knoweth the spirit of man that goeth upward and the spirit of the beast beast that goeth downward to the earth man and beast have a spirit but our spirit goes up and the spirit of the beast goes down look at chapter 12 of Ecclesiastes also Ecclesiastes chapter 12 verse 7 Then shall the dust return to the earth as it was, and the spirit shall return unto God who gave it. In other words, when we die, our body goes to the dust, sabi niya, oh? and the, then shall the dust return to the earth as it was, and the spirit shall return unto God who gave it. So kung mamatay ta, ang ato di ay alawa, siyempre mo ad tumadugta, ang ating spirito balik sa uh, ginoo, pero wala isguti diri ang soul. The soul uh, is your responsibility. Your soul is your everything. And, uh, you know, what is the soul all about in 1 Samuel chapter 18, verse 1? Chapter, 1 Samuel chapter 18, verse 1. And it came to pass when he made an end of speaking unto Saul that the soul of Jonathan was knit with the soul of David and Jonathan loved him as his own soul. So, we communicate with each other. We love each other because of soul. The soul, your soul, and my soul will knit together if we are, uh, we love each other as brothers and sisters. So, the soul is what communicate with people. You know, all men believe in a soul. But, you know, a man may say, I have no soul. I have no soul. But would be insulted. A man who says, I have no soul, would be insulted if he is berated. Huh? If he is called a dog. Pag itao, tawagon ni mo, o iro. Di na masugot. Pero ang iro, tawagon mo tao, Mutanaw lang ni mo. Tanaw ang iro. Tawag ang tao. Hindi na mo, di na mo kuhan. Pero ang tao, tawag ng iro. Hindi na mo sugot. Maglagot na. Why? Because man has a soul. Maglagot siya. 
because man has a soul. A man who says he has no soul only makes himself to believe what he says, but in reality, he knows he has a soul. Bisa palibot na ito, nagtuo may kalag, naman tayo kalag-kalag. Bisa, di ba kalag-kalag sila? O, oh, nagtuo sila ay kalag, pero, pero kalag-kalag lang ila. Pero na ay kalag. Natamadok bang gani ang mga tao nga kalagun sila? Nagtuo ang tao nga may kalag. So that is what is important to us. A communist, at one time, a communist, you know, they are godless people, a communist was heckling a, a preacher, a evangelist who was preaching on the, on the podium about the soul. I do not believe that man is a soul. There is no soul. There is no God. And I don't believe there is a soul. Wala, wala mag uh, wala mag uh, bother ang kuhan ang evangelist but he came down to the ground to the pulpit muna giadto niya ang iro na iro kasabay niya mga ang iro ang iro nagaano lang niya kasabay kasabay kasaba. kasaba nga dili makaon sa iro <laughs> niya wala mo, mo ni ato ang evangelist ni ato sa communist and said the same words he said to the dog. You know what happened? The communist reacted. Naglagot siya, man, manumbag siya. He goes, sir, 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 I'm just showing to you the difference between you and the dog. The dog won't react, but you will react because you have a soul. Tinitinoon na mo ba mo siya, di atong tukalag. There is a soul. Tinitinoon di ang Bible, for what shall it profit him and it against his the whole world has lost his own soul. Tinood nga may kalag ang tao. So, my friend, a man is capable of being ashamed because he has a soul. He is embarrassed, he is capable of being embarrassed because he has a soul. Ang atong uh, reaction because you have a soul. I have yet to find a dog or a pig, or a carabao, or a horse, or a cow that knows how to be embarrassed. Nakadungog na ba ka ng hero nga na, na, na ulaw? Baboy, na ulaw? Dili na sila maulaw because they are uh, soulless. Kita may kalagta. Ah, na utana na ako ba? One time. Nga naman ang, ang kabayo diya sa tabuan. Uh, tabunan man ang kuan mata. Ano, magbiraw ka kan. Ingon ingon ang ingon ko. Naulaw. Na di ka ulaw ang kabayo. Naulaw ay ka bay pabirahon ng karate karitela. Naulaw ka. Pero the truth is, gibutangan lang na siya eh, para di di siya makakita sa gawas nga dili siya ma-disturb. But actually, my friend, I'm telling you, we are talking here about the soul. We are talking about something that is in you. You know, kitang mga tao, may kalag, dili tama basta-basta. We are, when we are invited to eat, kare na dito, maulaw ta, may kaulaw ta. Dili ta dahil mapunitog pan, mag-usap ta. Maulaw ta because we have a soul. Kada, you know, a pig, a pig does not need invitation. Butang nga ng pagkaon diya, hap-hap da yun. Naabay, iro, uh, naabay baboy nga maulaw, mag- maulaw. May ngon, unya na lang, unya na lang. <laughs> habab na, oy! Nay, mga baptist nga, inana, ang habab na. <laughs> Ay, huwag ko may ngon ninyo nga, baboy ang inanang baptist. Pero, kita mga tao, kinanglan, imbitahon ta, usat ang mukhaon. Ang mga mananap, din na niyo, kinanglan, imbitahon. Imbita, That's why, the, the end of this, the, when, during the end of this message, I'm going, we are going to invite, give invitation, invitation for uh, uh, the soul. Nga sila, mag, mag ato sa ginoo. Ha? Huh? Mga egsoon. Animal, sabi mo, kung walang, kung walang kalag ang mga animal, ano mag-away man? Well, an animal, animals fight each other, pero afterwards, dili na, wala na sila mag-harbor. Dili sila mag-harbor o ill-will. Pero ang tao mag-away, Labi pa mga baptist, they will harbor ill will. Oh. Di na magtinggalay. 
Labi pa pag ang pastor ang kontrahon, dira, dili, 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 Animals, when they fight back, fight, fight each other, wala mag-harbor. Ha? Huh? Dili sila mag-harbor ng ilwil. Dili gani magkihay? Ang mga baptist, magkihay? Maulaw ta, oy. So, ako, may iruka, may iruka si Paa. Dagan na! O, oh, dagan! Pero balik na, pagbalik na, tilapan pang ang tiil nga ng kuwan niya. Suway si pa ang imong asawa. <laughs> Balik ba na? Muna, paggaon na ito itong asawa. Amen? Ako ang asawa, pinanggan ako na. I always tell my wife, pinanggan ako na. Ako ay magpainom sa iyang tambal. Ako ang kuwanan. Kaya di ba siya makamimuray sa tambal? Pero tinagahan ng tambal. Ako ay magbutangan na. Ihat ako, buntag na tambal. Oh. Oh. Tapos, gabi nga tambal. Ano siya, pagkabuntag, ako siyang, min, magkuan na ta, magka, gusto ka na magkapi, timplahan akong kapi. Pag na sa buntag dito sa balkonahin na mo, ready na pag-almusal. Naanay kapi, naanay, uh, kana na ang peanut butter, naanay sliced bread, naana. Tapos, magbasa lang siya ang Bible, basa, sa magkuan, basa. Pero ready na. That's why, la- oy, kita mga bana, atong, atong pagkaon na itong asawa, oy. Isa lang nga itong asawa. Gawas, huwag daw hangin mong asawa, amot na lang. Pero ako, isa lang akong asawa. Nya, ang atong asawa, ako ang asawa, sa, us, kanang, siyempre, mag, mag-away ta. Ha, mag-away ta. Mag-away, may asawa siya. Di, 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 na normal na nga. Ang mga asawa, di, di, mag-away. Ay, mag-away na. <laughs> Kaya, katawa man ka. <laughs> Aminado ka, no? <laughs> mag-away. Napagadihas sa kuan, sa sakinan, mag-away may musik, singkahan ako siya. Masingkahan na ito na kay Usay ang hawa, asawa, kinangalan singkahan, singkahan ba? Singkahan. Musing. Sabi ko, dahi, pag singkahan na ako ikaw, singka sa balik na ako. Pag singkahan na ako, musingka, mas nagsukusan ito. Dagana na! Nga, sarado man. Huwag may nakahibaw ako. Kita na, kita lang. <laughs> Nag-drive ka, sarado man. Pero, Normal man na, normal mag-away ang asawa. Pero mga igsoon, sultan mo ikaw, we love each other because we have a soul. You love your pastor because you have a soul. You love this church because you have a soul. Mga igsoon, maunig luwas yun sa ginoo. Dili siya mul- dili siya luwas o spirit. Dili siya luwas o body. Ang luwas yun niya, luwas yun nun, kalag. Kalag ang luwas nun sa ginoo. So, ako, ang ako minsahe ka ron, ang bot, nagtapsitarbi na ni. Our tax, Texas, for what shall it profit a man if he gains the whole world and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give in exchange for his own soul? Three things, I'll preach three things, which are um, apparent and in these verses. From the two key verses of the scriptures, namely, Tulo, the value of the soul, the vanity of the world, the vastness of the loss. You know, ang atong kalag, more ato. Kini ang kalibutan? Iya sa ginoon eh. Gitagaan ta sa ginoo, kalag, nga dili niya bawi on. Kita responsible na whether you go to heaven or you go to hell. Pwede ka muadtog ang hangit, kumpurmi sa imong preparasyon sa imong kalag. Muadtog ka sa impyerno, sumala sa imong pagneglect sa pulong sa ginoo. So, it is your everything. Your soul is everything. Kamara, nakabutang. So, what is the value of the soul? Huh? First, let us tackle the value of the soul. Number one, the artistry. You know, 
The soul is the soul workmanship of the Almighty God. Now open with me to Genesis chapter 2 verse 7. Genesis chapter 2 verse 7, the Bible says, And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground, and breath into his nostrils the bread of life, the breath of life, and man became a living soul. Now this biblical account makes it clear that only God creates and gives his soul to every man. Taksa, taksa na to may kalag. Way tao di rin hawaii da kalag. Whether you go to heaven or to hell, you have a kalag. Na atay kalag. Kanang inyong ipang-invite ng mga visitors, na anay kalag. That's why you invited them. That's why they, they, they uh, accepted your invitation because they have a soul. Di ba ka maka-invite to Giro? Dado ni Mundere. Tao, invite to ito. Muari sila. Kaya may kalag. And you know, this biblical account makes it clear that only God creates a soul and gives a soul to every man who comes into this world. That is why, folks, listen to me. We are against abortion. Because abortion is murder. Imagine ka, patyunin mo ang bata sa tiyan nga iyan ang gihimo sa ginoo. Once a, a, a fetus, uh, once a fetus is formed, nananay kalag na yun. O gwa kay katungod, nga tagtakon siya, gwa kay katungod, nga patyun siya. No matter what medicine is trying to proclaim, to say, to reason out, is still in all, they are not in the position to kill a fetus because that is murder. Muna nga, pagbantay ta na, iyan na sa ginoo. Ha? A soul that is perfectly engineered that your body would reject that soul because it is artistic. Ang God, artistry. Artistic ang ginoo. Tanawa na palibot ni mo. Tanawa na kung naging mong Lawas, oh, artist, artist ang ginoo. Taka ang kaglima, kat, katudlo, oh. tapos tatag, no? Pero yung nagpunit mo sa kanon, mapunit niyo mo. Tapos, art, met, na pa yung kataga ka na para mga ana. Piyaw niyo na kung wakay ana, wakay siko, sorry, paghimit. Listen, ako ng ginoo mo. Salamat sa ginoy. Naayos sa katawa nagadto sa sa kalugar. Tinghala siya mga tao maghungitay ba? Na nagnatatubang maghungitay, maghungitay. Mitay na discover niya way mga siko. Abi ni mo mas maayo pa wasi gulo tay siko aron maghungitay ta. Dindot ang ginoy. Gitaga ang tagkala, gitaga ang lawas, the temple of the Holy Ghost, tapos gitaga ang tagnindot ka yung mga artistic ang ginawa. He is artistic. Salamat ko. Nagitaga na akong nawong, ako lang. Imagine ka kung may nakoy nawong, nga pares na ako, ang akong asawa mo, ato sa pikas. Mayon na lang ako lang ang ako. Wow. Natigulang namin, na, nagkatiguan namin. Pag mata ko sa buntag, tanawon ako ako sa kilid. Tanawon ako ng tiyan kung nagaana pa, nag, kung ginawa pa. Aw <laughs> buhi pa. Siya di ay mo sa nangiyang buhaton. Pag tanawon niya ako na ako ay buhi pa. <laughs> I, I, I don't know if you are doing that. <laughs> Para karunay ko ginoo salamat buhi pa akong asawa. Nag-ana pa, nag-ana. Di ako nimra kun dilim nag-ana. Huwag patay na akong asawa. <laughs> ako ang gingin na akong asawa at nag-operahan ako sa ulo ba. Diri si Bo, di ha sa Tsonghua. Ay ko, min, kahimat yun ako. Usaw ni Mo, usaw ni mga plano ni Mo sa kinabuhi. Di na ako maugmaan, di na ako maugmaan. Patay ko. Usaw ni mga plano sa kinabuhi. Ayun ba ito bag niya? Sabi niya. Ano siya? 
magtuon ako drive. <laughs> Normally, ay why po siya, ayaw, ayaw, di ko gusto ba ka, gusto ko mabuhi pa ka, wala siya na na. Ingon siya, magtuon ako magdrive. <laughs> Oy, maka- may lisensya na. Oh, may license under the table. Pero nakuha niya lang. Nana! Talaga, pero hindi siya ka mga mag-drive. Sabi niya, ang lisod ko mag-drive ka ng paatras, di man ka mag-drive ang sigig atras. <laughs> Drive man ta, 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 forward man. Labisan pa. Alam mo, mga asawa, no, di li matukakatunog drive kaya nga naman, na may gisaligan nga ba na mag-drive. Ayan, ako ang asawa, di niya gusto mamatay ko. Kaya wala na si driver. <laughs> Sabi niya, mayon ta, mamatay ta dungan. Ay, gusto niya mamatay ng dungan. O siya ako ka na pagmatay ng dungan. Tutsulti ko ba eh. Kaya gusto, gusto niya dungan may mamatay. <laughs> Sabi ko, ah, na ilusolusyon. Mag-inong taghilo. <laughs> Parang Romeo and Juliet ba? Naihilo. Akong ginitan na ay hilo, pero siya'y unang inom. <laughs> Pag may inom, tanaw na ako kumukirig ba? <laughs> Karon, may inom na inom in- in- ako, oh. ambot lang. <laughs> Karon, naayotawa ba nga, dito sa menteryo ba? Oh. Sige siyang hilak, oh. tulog ka, patong ang iyong kuhan, puntos, ano? Sige, sige, lagdako nyo siya. Nay, nay, kuhan doon nga, Sir, grabe ni mo, no? Gihugog, gihugog mag yun ni mo ng mga nangamatay. Oo, oh, oh, sama ni mo siya, mga asawa na ko! Ah, siya. <laughs> siya. O, sige, kapat siya sa primero, naging na mo gilo. Ang ikadua, naging na mo sa dogilo. Ay, katulo, namatay, nabunog na ako. Nga nagibunog ni mo, di man mo inumog hilo. <laughs> Poor vida. Artistry. Balik tao eh. Yung si doktor, pag magwali ka, ayaw patawa. I said, I'll preach the word. Preach the word. I'll not preach my wife. Kasi kasagara mga pastor, they will preach about their wives. Sabi na ako ang asawa, ayaw ko pa kawawi dito ha. <laughs> Mag-war niya siya, di laki, di laki, kuyog lang. You know, God succeeded, he has to see that he gives it individual a soul that befits your body, nga dili mo reject. Natay ka lang, nga dili reject sa body no. Naka, nakaduog na baka nga, bata nga, gipanganak, mayroon, di, pag dako, di na ako gusto akong kalag, ilisi, ilisi. Eksakto ang kalag ihatag sa imo sa ginoo. He is a very good engineer, and the best engineer in the world can construct a mansion or a building, pero naagi mga depikto, there is a flaw in their construction, But with God, you can never find a flaw. You can never find a defect. That is why He never needs a kananaang uh, quality control. Ang mga engineer na kinahalang pag quality control. Ang ino, dili na exact. He is very artistic. Huh? Very artistic ang gino. Yeah, you know. Let, let me talk to you about this all. Dito sa Amerika, There is a national museum there. I don't know, I forgot where it is. But there is, if you enter there, there is a cabinet. In that cabinet, there is two, two jars of water, a jar with phosphate, lime, potassium, sodium, and other chemicals. Another jar filled with hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. Now, all these materials are given in the exact propor- proportion as combined, as a, a, in an ordinary man, re- weighing 150 pounds. Kung say 150 pounds, kana ang composition sa lawas. 
Pero you know what is missing there? In that cabinet? Why kalag? Kinaalan lang kalag. Wala dito ang kalag. So, you need, we need God to give a soul. Naayos na ka-engineer nga siya. Kaya na ako ginoo? Sa emo sikrito. Makahinumot na akong tao. I can now make man like what you do. So, gusto mo mag-contesta? Ingo na ang ginoo. Sige ko no, sige ko no. Sige, ikaw sugod. Sugod ang engineer, no? Primero ginoo, yuta man yung magamit. Puyot ka si yuta. Sige siya, hep, 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 hep. Pangita ka mong kaugaling yuta. Ako nang yuta. Wala, well, bisa nun sa ni mo, kinahala ni mo ang gibuhat sa ginoo pa. You know, we cannot challenge God. So, kining atong kalag is artistic. Not only number two, uh, it's not only art, soul's artistry, but soul's durability. Dili ni mamatay. If you remember, there is a there is an account in hell in John in Luke chapter uh, 16 about the two the the, white, the rich man and the poor man Lazarus who died. Lazarus was taken up into Abraham's bosom, and the rich man uh, went to hell. And in hell, the Bible says, he lifted up his eyes. Listen to me, my mata di ay ang tao sa impierno. He lifted up his eyes. And see it, Lazarus sa parop, he said, Father Abraham, have mercy on me and let Lazarus dip his finger. Saan pa may finger? Dip his finger in water to cool my tongue. Saan pa may tang? Kumpleto ang tao sa impyerno. Ang ang, matalang, tudlo, o gila, magana-ana. Kunay mata, nay ulo, may... Nay ulo na, kunay ulo, nay liog, kunay liog, may lawas, kung may lawas, may tiir, kumplito. Pero ang mga tao, baliwalaon lang nila. So, durable, dili mamat, dili mawagtang, dili mamatay ang kalag, dili mawa. Ha? That is why the soul, when the soul shall cannot be extinguished, it will go on to live for eternity. Uh, in heaven or in hell. That is why salvation of soul is still the major responsibility of the Church of God. And alongside this responsibility is the uh, continuing duty of the Church to nurture and edify and sanctify the soul. That is what Church is all about. May una kita nga dito, dito mag-absent sa Church. Dito mawa sa Church. If you remember here, always come here. You do not forsake the assembling of yourselves together as the manner of some is because you are nurtured, you are edified, you grow here and as much as possible, you die here para bendisyon ng pastor. This is our place. Mga Iksoon, that is why I tell you we are responsible. The last command of Jesus in this, in, to His uh, church before he went up to glory he said go ye therefore and that is uh, Matthew chapter 28 go ye therefore and teach all nations baptizing them in the name of the father and the son of the holy ghost teaching them to observe all things whatsoever uh, i have commanded you and lo i am with you always and even unto the end of the world church Sino man nasa church? Kita! The church is we. Kita. Gihatag ni. We have to teach all nation about bap- salvation. Then, there is a pulpit and let us baptize them. We encourage them to be baptized in the name of the Father and of the Holy Ghost. Teaching them to observe that is discipling. Mga Iksun, mauna ito responsibility. Church members, at responsibility, kalag! Why lain? Di na ito responsibility ang magbantay sa pastor. Di na ito responsibility ang magbantay sa usag-usa. Di na ito responsibility ang mag- mag-usisa sa mga chismis-chismis. That is not the responsibility we are here for. The soul is our responsibility. If we focus our eyes, 
if we focus our mind, if we focus our heart to the salvation of souls, I tell you, way away, away sa iglesia. Way, way problem, problema ang iglesia. Nagkakaproblema ang iglesia kasi ang mga members, di liman mo ay tumong nila ang kalag. Ang tumong nila, kinsay akong ragaan ng business diri. Ang tumong nila, kinsay akong baligyaan diri. Ang akong, ang akong tumong, kinsay may mutanga na ako diri. Oh, naiilang lang ko. Kinsa, 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 saan ako makakwarta? Now I tell you what, this church is not for business. Money business, dili. We have a business and that is what is being told us in Matthew chapter 28. The Great Commission. Pag dili ka mag, mag-follow ni ini, makonsumisyon. Imbis na Great Commission, konsumisyon. Ang unang makonsumi, ang pastor. Puti na rabang buhok. Ako, di, di pa ako kayo. Kaya mo si Pablo, I die daily. Ako, I die monthly. <laughs> Ikaw, di na ka magdai. <laughs> That is biblical. <laughs> ako tigtina sa akong asawa. Tapos siya na po magtina sa ako. Ano, ano ba? Give and take. Magtina me. Pero that is, that is beside the point. I, I die monthly. We die monthly. But folks, I tell you what. The value of the soul as to artistry The value of the soul as to durability, diri mamatay, and the value of the soul as to its rarity. Very rare. Di ka na makakita, Tony, nga laing kalag, ako lang. Di ka na makakita, uh, Dr. Gisal ba nga kalag, siya lang. Very rare. Pag mawala ng kalag, di nakakita. It's very rare. Huh? What makes the soul rare is that it has no duplicate. Why duplicate? There is no other you. There is no other uh, Sibunga. There is no other ra, Rapi. There is no other like you. Huh? You are you. That is why the title here of the message is Your soul is your everything. So, we are made in, this, we are, we are made in the image of God. It is said that has Saddam Hussein When he was still living, he had so many look alike. Para di makatago siya. Muramuro siya. Sada mo siya. Pero di real. Sada mo siya. Di kakaila. Pero no matter what, bisan daga ka pang look alike. That you're alike as so his soul of his own. You have your soul of his own. Kita na at tayo soul sa atong kaugalingon. Very rare. Pag mawala ng atong kalag, wa na'y duplicate. You know what is rare? You know, you know the world has many rarities. The rarer, the more valuable. For example, there is a rare Madonna painting worth millions of dollars. Painting lang ha? Millions of dollars. Very rare. A rare 14 cent stamp of Guiana, British Guiana is worth uh, $70,000. Gamay lang yung stamp? $70,000? Ha? A rare coin of Athens cost $60,000. But my friend, the rarest thing in the world is the soul. Very rare. The rarer, the costlier. And if the soul is the rarest, it is the costliest commodity around. And because the soul is man, man is rare, it has no spare parts. Man's body can now enjoy spare parts. Mayroon ang ako ng spare parts nga para hearing aid. Nawala ng ako hearing aid. Suko akong asawa, 45,000. Gibutang na ako diri, makadungog na ko. Wow! Klaro kayo, karon di na ako kadungog. Pag lalo na, pag may maningil sa balay, di na ako kadungog. <laughs> Pero pag may magbayad, hasta makadungog ko. <laughs> oh, very rare. Aka ng spare parts. Ha? Mayroong spare parts sa heart, ako giumpirahan sa heart. Pero wala, it change. Giritoki lang. There is a spare parts for kidney, for the eye, for the artificial arm, artificial leg, artificial teeth, artificial tanan. Mabita, usahay kita, mga artificial lang atong, uh, kung saan sa atong mga igsuon. Let us be true. Amen? 
magpakatotoo tayo. Kasi ang pag-artificial, di lima ay pa minahon. Naigikasal ba nga, bagong kasal. Pag human sa kasal, ito na sila sa ilang kuwan, ah, honeymoon bed. Ang, ang, ang lalaki, nagsugod na siya kay kuwan, kay mag-honeymoon na good. Gitang-tang iyang mata. <laughs> Tapos ang iyang ipon. <laughs> ang iyang arm. Hindi <laughs> Ang iyang leg. Ganan. Ang tiil niya. Prostetic. Ang, ang iyang bride ba? Muta na siya. Dear. Kisa wala akong dulugan ka ng spare parts o ikaw. <laughs> Gamay na lang nabilid sa bana niya. Mura nagkuhan. Mura tuod. Tuwata na ng spare part. Oh. Tayo. Tayo. Walang spare parts ang kalag. Everything in this world has turned artificial. Have you heard? Kaya wala nang totoo dito sa kamundo. Napapagod na tayo, puro artificial. That's why here on the church, let us be true. Dili tayo magpaka-artificial. Mapagod na ating pastor, mapagod na kayo. Puro artificial ang ating kanang relationship. Let us be true to each other. Amen? Kung nagpakatotoo pa tayong lahat, punong-puno ito. Eh, yung iba nag-alisan. Sabi na, di na kung gusto ang church, di ato sa lain. Pag ato sa lain, mauho sa gihapon. Sabi nila na ay perfect church. There is no perfect church. Wala ay perfect church. If you are to, if there is a perfect church, ayaw ka ato, kaya dauton lang ni mo. Leave it alone. If there is a perfect church, I have na ilab ti perfect sila. Musud pa ka agoy. You will be poisoning the church. Minor dere dili ta perfect. Pero our God is perfect. Amen. Perfect ang Ginoo. Og sulti ko mo, perfect ka mo sa tubangan sa Ginoo. Ang inyong kalag durable, ang inyong kalag inyo lang very rare ang inyong kalag ikaw ra gyud. God's Adi uh, souls, uh, ang sunod nato ay kadua. The artistry, its uh, durability, its rarity. Second, point number two. The vanity of the world. What does it profit a man if he gains the whole world and suffer the loss of his soul? Now here is the world and the soul contrasted. Ha? Huh? Makita na to. Soul and the world Contrasted. As the Bible says, what does it profit a man? Sulter ko ka mo. Kita gusto na ito o ganansya? Tungod gusto na ito o ganansya? Ha? Magpakabuang ta sa pagmagkaganansya? Bisan pa magganansya ni mong tibo kalibutan? Dili katandi ang kawala sa imong kalag kung dili kaluwas. Kaya nakita mo. Na a man said to a Christian, you know, I would give the world to have your joy and peace. Kita mga Kristiyanon, makita nila lahat ng tao, maka-smile ta sa kalisod, makakatawa ta sa mga uh, trials, ah, maka, maka-inclusive ta, bisan nagkalisod, nagkakuang, nagkabuang-buang, mga isla, nagkabuang-buang. Nga naman nga ng mga Kristiyanon, ingo na na. Ingo na siya, you know, I will give the world to have your joy and peace of mind. You know what the Christian's reply is? The Christian said, That is just what it cost me. I give the world for it. My son, ayaw kita may gugma sa kalibutan. Pag di ka may gugma sa kalibutan, may gugma ka sa buluatan sa ginoo. Pero pag may gugma ka sa kalibutan, sultihan ko ikaw. Dili ka may gugma of the things of God. Mauman ang imo. That is why we are being told, Love not the world. Neither the things that are in the world. For everything in the world. Huh? The lust of the eyes, the lust of the flesh, the, the pride of life is not of the Father, but it's of the world. Kisa man, this world will pass away. Sunogon. Pagkakaroon. But we, kita, nga mga iya sa ginoo that abide in the Word of God, we will last forever. Magsama-sama tayo sa langit. Mga Iksoon, sultihan ko ka mo nga, you know, the world is all vanity. Di pa kasi, my friend, 
nobody gained the whole world. Alexander the Great almost conquered the whole of Europe, almost but not quite. The eccentric Howard Hughes, a very rich man, bought a large share of almost all the major corporations in the U.S. Almost all, but not quite. Ex-President uh, Marcos almost became the king of the Philippines and almost succeeded in changing the name of our country from the Philippines to Maharlika. Almost, but not quite. Bulkaya of Brunei, Brunei is one of the richest men in the world, but cannot gain the whole world. Yeah. Bill Gates is worth $60 billion, but if, even if you double that amount, he cannot gain the whole world. Nobody gains the whole world. Pero kita, abi nato, magayin kalibutan. The rich men and women of the world like Rocky Taylor, Ford, Queen Elizabeth, Imelda Marcos, Elizabeth Taylor, and other affluent personalities think that they are on top of the world, but only to realize that the, re that the rightful place is six feet below the ground. You know how to six feet below the ground? You know, in the United States, mataas na ba akong wali, Dok? Taas na? Hapit na akong mag-end? Ay, ako. Dito sa Amerika, katong mga pilgrims, when they arrive in the in the uh, promised land, big to sa America, wala pa may mga titulo. So, how do they own lands? Tagaan ka og four stakes ka nang pangatutusok mo sa yuta. Tagaan sila ng four stakes. Karon, you start here. Pat! Dagan ka! Pagkabot ito! Pat! Dagan ka na na! Pagkabot ito! Tuk! Tapos, tagan na! That is your property. The longer you run, the bigger your property. Mo na sa una, karon one man, one uh, pioneer wanted very greedy. He was given the four stakes and I said, "Shh, ala dagan sa dito, dagan 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 taas 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 taas." Pagabot dito, pat dagan na punsa dito, pitaas niya yan dagan, pat pagabot niya dagan sa pat balik siya, pagbalik niya namatay. <laughs> ah, namatay sa pagod. You know what he gained? He gained usalang kadupa ang ayuta. And then, hinukay six feet under the ground. Mura na kato. Kita, mag-away-away sa ayuta. Oh, ha? Ang mga mag-isuon, mag-away sa ayuta. Ha? De, eh, kanang ilahin lang ang kuan, ang, ang usakadangaw, ilahin lang ang, ang kuan muhon, mag-away na, mag-dimag-kihay na, mag-isuon watay at kanang ayuta. Bisag, Na ako eh, kailan, nagsakasakay sa aeroplano ba? Yung e, siya, abinin mo, nagkuha nga mong yuta diri sa Dabao. Pwede tinakuha. Ayaw ko mauba. Namino lang ko. Yung nagkasakay sa aeroplano. Pagkabot sa taas, akong gingin na, nasa man ang inyong yuta? Hindi <laughs> niya ma-pinpoint. He cannot pinpoint. Because we are just a tiny speck in humanity. But being a tiny speck in humanity, the Lord found His way down from heaven to earth to die on the cross for the tiny speck of humanity, you! Gipakamat niyang ka sa ginoo. Tiny speck lang ta. Gamay lang ta. Pero gipakamat niyang ka sa ginoo. Wa magpakamatay ang ginoo sa bisagunsa. Wa siya magpakamatay sa kalibutan sa mga yuta, bisagunsa. He came to earth to seek and to save that which are lost. Pasalamat ta! Nakita ang ta sa ginoo. Og sa diyan nakita ta. Giluwas ta. Og sa diyan giluwas ta. Gibutang ta diri sa iglesia. Og sa diyan gibutang ta sa iglesia. Malipayo na ta. Amen. Ayo na ta mag you know I tell you this world is corrupt. Sabi nga ni Duterte, tanan mga anak ko official mang corrupt. Mga opisyal mga kurap. Because the world is kurap. It has been corrupted by Satan. Na, the corruption of the world. The character of the world. What is the character of the world? Alluring. Kung ka, kananaang, pakitaang kag mga maimutang. That is why there is advertising. Nadala ta sa advertising. 
bagong sapatos. Ah, duha lang ang tiil nimo, but you have 20 pairs of shoes. Unsaon nimo na? Butang nimo dire. You have only one body, daghang kang mga indot. Kani kani? Dugay na ni. <laughs> Balik-balik ni dire pero kusa ra man akong lawas. So, ano? Ngano kita padala ta sa ana? character of the world we are being allured we are being attracted we are being uh, we are being uh, tantalized na by para sa mga cool gate mother brother sister sister how do you brush your teeth ingon tong tigura i don't brush my teeth anymore because i don't have teeth <laughs> madala ko ba nana ya bang advertise nga ayaw na mo ana so, karakter. Ayaw ta padala na. Tano, dili ta magsigig tanawa na. Meron ta na ang itan tanawang nanunay. Kini, oh. Kini, Dok. Tara ang Bible, pero sabi niya, sabi ni Pastor, ayan, karaan na yung Bible, no? Oh, pero Bible man, bisa mo siyang karaan. Basta, maurang kaya pa ng sulod. Ay, so, matrak, ako matrak ko sa mga Bible nga bago, pero Tang-tangon ako ng NBO eh. Parehas man ang unod ano eh. Cover lang may nagdaog. So, character of the world. The condemnation of the world. What is happen to, going to happen to the world? 2 Peter chapter 3 verse 10. The Bible says in 2 Peter chapter 3 verse 10, the world is condemned. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in the which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, and the elements shall melt, melt with fervent heat. The earth also, and the works that are therein, shall be burned up. And Peter continued to say, Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of person? What manner of person shall you to be in holy conversation and holiness? My son, so tell ko kamo. Kung natay na kang butang, sunugo na. Mas mayo pa, gamito na ito na. Sabulo ito sa ginoo. Daga kang yuta. Paggahe ng yuta sa ginoo. Para sa magamit sa bulo ito. Nakay na kang kwarta, ihulog sa offering. Kung saan ni mo na? Kaya, huwag ta magtasimbahan. Tabangan na itong bulaton sa ginoo. That is why you were saved to serve. That is why you sa- were saved to give. Give what you need to give. Let us not hoard. Ikaw ng Bible, sunugo na. Sunugo ng tanang ang kalibutan. Huwag tanang kabuatan. Kaya kita dagantang ihod. Akin, 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 akin. Para tang manok ba? Ang manok sige meng akin 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 akin. Nakakita ka manok na iyo iyo iyo. Ano <laughs> manok na na no? Kaya manok ka na man. Kita po mura tag manok. Akin akin akin. Magminanok ta imo iyo iyo. Ngayon. Ayaw ta pagminanok. Pasalamat ta. Di la pa, di ta pare sa baboy ang baboy abi ninyo di makahangad. Oh, oy baboy makahangad. Pero wa say mas ana ang ako. Gusto niya mo hangad di sa kahangad. May pata makahangad. Nya sige ta magre ako sa Ginoo. Hangad, magpraise. Amen, Lord. Amen. Ha? Huh? Mo abot ang panahon di ka na mo hangad. Ana na lang ka. Asa ko mo ganan siya ani. Asa ko mo ganan siya. Sultihan ko ikaw, magkakasakit ka. Pagkasakit ni mo, naka na sa ospital, sige na kaghangad. <laughs> Tapos ang hangin ni mo, bayra na ni mo. Tag, uh, 20 pesos kada hisgok. <laughs> 20 pesos. <laughs> Ngayon, libre. Libre. But the world, mag is trying to make, uh, to, to influence us. Eh, hatag na nato sa, sa ginuang mga nabili natong mga, kung hindi na nato kinahanglan. Pag nanakay bag, ayaw na pang itaglayang bag. Akong bag, kausa lang, kausa lang. Parang kami, ang mga babae, bili na, bili na bag. Oh, one time, 
Nagtulo pa ako, nagtulo pa ako sa Bible school. Ako ang ginan ako sa awa kay magpangin sa ipakawit ko nun yung akong bag. Sabi ko, kada nga namang bag diya. So, amin na pagitan sa manukog ko. Ipangatag na! So, ang imaw, mamay, na, na-convicted siya. Pag-graduate sa mga Bible student, din yung mababay, ipangatag niya ang bag! Ang uwan, tagtulo, tagupat, hasta lipaya mga graduating student na may bag. Katanawa, di na kamalimta na na, ipapray pa ka na. Pasalamat sa signo, tungod ni mo. Ay, mong bag, daghan! Mga babae, daghan bag. Uy, kamon mga babae, usaw na inyo ang bag. Ha? Oh, tanawa na, kaya ba ako, daghan mong bag, no? Mira, hmm. ano ka, ha, no? Ang uban, daghan sapatos. Ako ang asawa, dagan sapatos. Ako sa dagan sapatos. Pero nakadugay, nakadagan. Naka, naka, ah, ako ipanghatag sa mga misyonaris dito sa kuan. Tago ka na. Sige, 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 sige. Ingon siya, Pastor, bago pa man eh. Ala, sige, sige, sige. Pero, tatag na to. Ayun na ito, mag, magpaabot nga. Magka, magkatemblang, temblang at itong kinabuhi sa natin panghatag. Eh, atag! Give, give. It shall be given you. Press down, shaking together, and running over. Shall man give unto your bosom? Because what we tell her, you, you give. We tell it shall be given to you again. Give and give and give. It's more blessed to give than to receive. Ah, tanga na tuna, lanayo na. So, kwan mga ikson. Katapusan. The loss of his soul is vast for three reasons. The loss of the soul is irreplaceable. Listen to me, if you are here, dili ka luwas, ha? dili na na, ang kalag ni mo, dili na mailisdan. Ha? It is irreplaceable. The loss of the soul is irreplaceable. Replaceable. There is no second chance. When you lose your soul, there is no in hell. That's, that, that's it. Finish ka na. Pag ang kalag ni mo, to as impirno, tuwan na ka. Hindi na ka makakuhan. Hindi yeah. na ka Ingo si Abraham, kaya ingo na ang, ang rich man dito, Father Abraham, I have par- palihog in town. Pariya si, si let Lazarus come down and dip his tongue, his finger in, in water and cool my tongue. Ingo si Abraham, saan? Di na ka, ang tao di rin, di makaana sa nimog. Siya na adya sa impirno, di na makaari. But Father Abraham, I have five brethren. Papuntahin sila doon, pagpadalan sa Lazarus doon, so that they will hear the message, that they will not come in this place of torment. Tiyaw ni muna, ang kalag sa impyerno, mao'y nag-ampo para sa kalag sa kalibutan. Unya kita, mga buhi, dire, mayang kahimtang, dito mag-ampo para sa mga kalag na wala mga luwas. May pade ang kalag sa impirno. And I tell you what, ang kalag sa impirno ay siguro basing inyo ng pariente that who prayed long time ago, Lord, doon ako uh, dito sa Katipunan Street. Pag to ang somebody to tell him, bas- basing i-answered prayer na in sa inyo, na nag Now listen to me, visitors. You do not know that God listened to the prayer of your relative in hell. Lord, Pato ang isa ka uh, missionary, pato ang isa soul winner sa akong lugar. Araw na ako, di maadto di, di sila. Nini nagdila ang mga kalayo. Now, listen to me. If somebody invited you, it's because maybe it is answered prayer from someone, your relative who is suffering in hell. O gipadadaan ka o tao nga nag-imitar ni mo diri. Araw di na ka maadto sa nagdila ang mga kalayo sa impirno. Who knows? I'm just telling you an hypot- hypothetical uh, story, ha, pero we do not know. Huh? So, secondly, it's not only uh, the uh, the loss is the loss is immeasurable. The whole world compared uh, it cannot compare to the loss because of value of the soul is immeasurable. Huh? By world standard, the loss of it is, is measurable. Most people take lightly about their soul's destiny. Kung warningan ni mo, dayon ingon, si Lord na ang bahala. Suti ako ikaw. Dili si Lord ang bahala. Ikaw ang bahala. 
if you are here tonight because somebody invited you, you heard this message of salvation, ikaw ang bahala mo dawat. Di, ka ma, di mo kamay mo sa gino, ikaw na lang ang bahala, padawaton, padaw, da, luwas ako, dili, ikaw ang bahala. Nang uban ningon kung ang saya ako namataan, may akong pakamatyan, ano na ang ganyan, ano mga pang, di ba? Ang saya ako namataan, mao na akong pakamatyan, but-but! Nga naman but-but, natawo ka nga hubo, Why sinina? Pagkatapos, nagsinina lagi ka. Di ba yung pakamat siyang pagkahubo ni mo? Natawa ka sa, sa kalibutan. Nga, huwag ka ikaalam mo. Nga, kailan mo. Huwag ka ikaalam. Nga, ano nag-eskwila man ka lagi? Kung kontento na ka, kung sinamatan ni mo, namatan ni mo nga, banga ka, huwag ka nabanan, pakamat siya ninyo yung pagkabanga. Nga naman nag-eskwila ka lagi. Dili na tinuhod. Mga sulti-sulti, ayaw mo sulti, mati mo tuuan ang mga, kung ako'y namataan, may akong pakamat dyan. Oh, di na tinood. Wala sila masahid sa ilang gisulti ng implikasyon. Ha? So, and to think that their idiotic alibi will be, ah, uh, ah, uh, kung ano ka nang, dito sila itangbo sa liyot ng kalayo sa impyano, and the loss of the soul is irreplaceable, It is immeasurable. And number three, the loss of the soul is inexcusable. Huwag kayo excuse kung wato kang impyerno. Nga naman, naana ang pulong. Ha? Tanawan na God. Tanawan na God sa Romans chapter 1, 19 and 20. Ah, and I will end. Romans chapter 1, verses 9. 19 and 20. Okay. Listen. Because that which may be known of God is manifest. Kaya baon na sila, unsag yun, ang ginoo, makita nila, ha? gipakita sa ila. For God that showed it unto them, gipakita sa ginoo, nga dagyo ginoo. For the invisible things of Him from the creation of the world are clearly seen, being understood by the things that are made, even His natural power and Godhead. Nakita nila, so that they are without excuse. If tonight, you do not receive the Lord Jesus Christ because of your religion, because of your uh, upbringing, because of your friend, your mother, your father, na hadlok ka, your fear, sultiha ko ikaw. You are without excuse. It's time now that you receive the Lord as your personal Savior because that is the only way that you can gain entrance to heaven. There's no other way. Wala good. Jesus Christ said without mincing words, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. He said, Ako lang andalan. May nangutaran ako ng anong dagang reliyon. Because they do not believe uh, John chapter uh, that 16.4 nga, I am the way, the truth, and the life. They are looking for another way. Unsa ka pa, paagi? They are looking for another truth. Unsa may tinuod? The truth is already here. The way is already here. Usa ka libro, pakita ang kagpaagi ng ito sa langit. Dili dagang libro. And This book is telling you that Jesus is the life. Siya lamang makahatag na ito o bagong kinabuhi. And if you are here tonight and you hear this message of salvation and the invitation is given and you do not make a, a, a decision to receive the Lord, you are without excuse. Di ka na makapanguli pa sa ginoo. So, The ball na is now in your direct if with you. Ang ball na asa imo. If you are not saved, you don't know where your soul would go the moment you die. You need the Lord. You need to confess to the Lord, Lord, I'm a sinner. I want to receive you as my personal Savior. Forgive me of my sin. Yan lamang. Imagine ka. Listen to me. And the cross at Calvary, 2,000 years ago, Jesus was hanging on the cross. 
he's about to die. He was about to give up the ghost. But here is a thief who finally find, come to himself. And he looked up and he said, Lord, remember me when thou comest into thy kingdom. Nagmakaluoy siya. Lord, remember me when thou comest into thy kingdom. And Jesus Christ was there on the side. On the side and he looked down at him. Now tell me, tell me, if Jesus Christ says, wait a minute, what is your religion? He did not ask about religion. Because the religion confuses. He did not say, Tempa, let, wait a minute, have you been baptized? Jesus Christ did not ask about baptism. Because baptism has done nothing to do with salvation. He did not say, wait a minute, what good works have you done? He did not ask, what's my mind? Because salvation is not about good works. The righteousness of peace of God. And he did not say, wait a minute, kawatan kang dako, giuli na ni mo imong kinawat. He did not say that. Wala sa gisgutan when the, when the thief said, Lord, remember me when thou comest into thy kingdom. Jesus Christ looked down upon him and said, Today! Today! Thou shalt be with me in paradise. Today, because salvation is at the moment, you recognize that Jesus Christ is Lord. The Bible, the thief said, Lord, he recognized Jesus as his Lord. He said, remember me when thou comest into thy kingdom. He believed that Jesus Christ is king. He has a kingdom. And he said, when thou comest into thy kingdom, he believed that Jesus Christ, if he dies that very moment and is buried, he will rise again from the dead and take him to heaven. And Jesus Christ, today thou shalt be with me in paradise. What a simple pronouncement from the Lord Jesus Christ. And tonight, you can be saved if you are just like the thief who recognized Jesus as Lord and Savior and King. So, Maura, may problema, may exoon. Huh? The loss of the soul. What is the soul? Let's go back to our ang atong kuan the value of the soul the vanity of the world the vastness of the loss and my friend tonight I'm telling you uh, what the Bible wants you to do there are only two kinds of people he that believe it is condemned he that believe it not is condemned but he that believe it is not condemned duha lang kaklasin tao direct they condemn and, the not con and those who are not condemned. So tonight, if you are here, you don't know where your soul would go the moment you die, please, please, do not hesitate. Just receive the Lord tonight, and salvation will be yours, free. Why bayad? You won't have to pay anything because Jesus Christ paid for it on the cross at Calvary.